Taylor Swift takes over all the charts, 6 ix 9 celebrates being free, and BTS gets explosive with new singles. Hey, it's Tetris, and these are your top stories for Monday, August 3rd. When I felt like I was an old card again under someone's bed. Holy Taylor Swift. My girl, our queen Taylor Swift's new album, Folklore, has debuted at number one on the Billboard 200 Albums chart, as well as her single, Cardigan, has debuted at number one on the Billboard Hot 100, making her the first artist ever to debut on both charts in the same week. Congrats, Taylor! Let's break down this momentous occasion. I knew you, you heartbeat on the high line once in 20 lifetimes. I Folklore starts with 846,000 equivalent album units earned in the U.S. in the week ending July 30th, according to Nielsen Music MRC data. That marks the largest week registered for any album since Swift's own Lover, which debuted at number one on the September 7th, 2019 data chart with 867,000 units. And with just one week, it makes her the highest selling album of 2020. And that's not it. Taylor has also smashed the Billboard Hot 100 chart as Cardigan Battle at number one, fan favorite The One comes in at number four, and Exile featuring Bonnie Iver launches at number six. You are my crown, now I'm in exile seeing you out. And 6 9 has a completely different reason to celebrate. Shake it back, pull nani nani, fat pull nani nani, that tsunami nami. 6 9 is free from house arrest, and to celebrate, he dropped a wild new music video for his song Punani as concerns build for his safety. The video has grabbed over 21 million views since its release on August 2nd, and he's celebrating his freedom saying on Insta, I'm free, who said we ain't outside? And also jumped on IG Live. A lot of people wanna say, yo, why are you always around a whole bunch of security? But some say 6 9 whose real name is Daniel Hernandez, better watch his back after his trial testimony labeled him a snitch on his game. His lawyers have expressed safety concerns, telling the New York Post in June, quote, lots of people condemn Danny for cooperating with the government. Even a young gang member who wants to make a name for himself could try something. And flaunting cars and cash might add extra ammo for his need for security. Why your favorite rapper dead right now with bullet holes in his face? You talking about? And to top off today's news, BTS has announced the name of their English single, and Tayo Cruz may have a reason to be jealous. Big Hit Entertainment shared that the single is titled Dynamite, spelled out on a pink background on Twitter. As previously announced, the song will be arriving August 21st, and the army will turn on. That's it for today. Running it down for you always, I'm Tetris Kelly for Billboard News.